Good morning, greetings, salutations, YouTube. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. I'm here in the kitchen with Mom, and something just came in the mail that we are super duper excited about. Uh, we have been looking at this little Instant Pot for a hot second. We thought it was so cute. We love Star Wars. The kids are obsessed with Star Wars. And this Instant Pot went on sale twice. It went on yes. sale the first time and it was like around ninety something dollars. Ninety nine dollars. And, and then I was gonna buy it, it was, but I forgot. And then it was three dollars more off. So it was only like what sixty? Wow. So I know. It is even more on sale. So this is like the R2 D2 instant pot version. It's a little bit smaller than the one we have, which is great for when we're gonna make something like not as like big or whatever as we usually make or sometimes we'll need two instant pots because what we eat a lot <laughs> uh, plus like when we have parties again in the future we'll be able to have two instant pots but this one like i said is a little bit smaller right mom six quarts the other one is eight quarts <gasps> what we don't oh. always fill it up like yeah Unless make oh two. my gosh, it's, it's so cute. It is the cutest little instant pot you've instant ever pot. seen. Oh, that is so cute. They have different ones. Of Star yeah, they have different Star Wars versions, but this one's our favorite because I think it looks. Also, some of the, the other ones are not on sale. We like R2D2. R2D2. Because it actually is almost the shape of R2D2 too, because which is perfect. It's blue. And Eliza's favorite color is blue. <laughs> it literally almost looks like it's. Oh, yeah, you can tell the inside is like a little smaller. But um, we're going to be using this today because mom is going to make her famous chili. Yep. So it's going to be perfect for in here. And we can use it for the first time. So I'm very, very excited. Uh, I'm going to have the Instant Pot link down below if you guys want to check it out. If uh, Maybe it's still available. I'm not 100% sure. But it was a really, really, really good deal. And it did come really fast. So that was cool too. Well, I'm going to show you guys how I make my garlic toast with uh, my egg. So I have a, I just toasted this bread. I have my garlic bread dip right here and we're just going to spread it along the top of the toast it's super duper easy that's why I love this stuff it's like silver as a towel spread it over there like that beautiful then we will add an egg onto it. This is the one that I was just cooking. Put it on top like this. We just have a little salt and pepper on there. Then we're gonna add my everything but the bagel seasoning. Order the big stuff. This is like a big bottle from uh, from Amazon. So much cheaper, and it tastes exactly the same as Trader Joe's. So, sorry Trader Joe's, but this one is cheaper. <laughs> and voila, that's it. So good. Mom's gonna taste it because she's never tasted it before. No, I don't wanna taste that. <laughs> All right, you guys, let us take a bite out of this it is so good i just like to break the yolk and like spread it all around like that cool. i know not everyone likes yolk but i love it like runny what does the yolk taste like delicious mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. if you want if you're watching right now, it's so so good. So here you guys have to listen carefully because I'm going to give you mom's secret recipe. <laughs> so first of all, screenshot this. So there's two diced tomatoes, two turkey chili with beans, one black beans, sweet corn, and cream of mushroom. Mom said you could also use cream of chicken. Yeah. And then in the microwave we have some ground beef that's yeah. defrosting. I think it's done. 
And how much of how much ground beef is this? A pound, a pound of of ground beef or ground turkey, and then you're just gonna add how much onion and. Depends on how big your onion is. Okay, we're gonna show you guys how much she's gonna use. One regular sized onion. Yeah. Like this. I mean, you can't really go wrong with onion. You can we put like more onion. onion, less onion. <laughs> and then how much we garlic are you onion. gonna put, Mom? I use like... One. I like garlic. Two, three. Maybe four. Four or five. Five. Make About five. five cloves of garlic and then one medium regular sized onion. It if you don't yeah, if you don't have to put all of it, if you yeah. don't like it, and then salt and pepper for the meat, right? Yep. And that's it? Yeah. Okay, you guys, that's the recipe. Write it down. It's really, really good and then, it's really delicious. Then you put uh, salt and pepper to taste. And uh, I put uh, how I put chili. Powder. And chili powder. How much? Like a teaspoon? Well, it depends on your taste. If you want it spicy, you put more. If you don't want it to spicy. Yeah, you can start off with a little bit and then keep adding because you yes. can always add more, but you but can't you take, away. take away. And everything's just going to go inside this little guy right there. This one has a saute mode. You know, the instant pot. Yes, yeah, so so you can saute it. You can saute it in, on this. Yeah, that's nice. That's what we like about the instant this pot. Is, a big onion. is that a large onion? onion? Yeah. You should just put the whole thing because I love onions. <laughs> I would put two onions. No. Like when when I'm the one that makes corned beef with onion, I use like a whole onion and you only use like yes. half of an onion. <laughs> yes. You, you make onions with corned beef, not yeah. corned beef with onions. I really like onions. They're really good. Yummy. Mom, it's the same exact one Instant Pot makes it. It just has a different picture. <laughs> it just looks like a robot. No, because there is one that's, um, that's the Instant Pot. Oh, what is that? That looks like so many so things. So cute. But it's so cute. I like it. It's the cutest. That's the cutest Instant Pot. Oh, uh, it's like painted on. Mm-hmm. I like that. It's so much fun. <laughs> the other one is so old already. You've used the other instant pot to death. See, but they don't make this in the largest size. Like, they don't make the ones with cute designs in the larger size. Yes, they don't. They only make them in, like, the second to largest size. And do they make them in, like, the smallest one? Like, the tiniest one? I feel like they also make them in that size, too. Let's just take this thing off right there. Are we going to cook it over here next to the kids? So that Eliza can look at it? Yeah. You're going to have to unplug all your stuff though. Right? The kids have their own little barbecue sauces right there. <laughs> Alright you guys, here's the lineup of everything that you need. Salt, uh, chili powder, pepper, Cream mushroom, all the canned stuff. We have our pound of meat. We have our garlic, onions, beans, and then our little hot pot or instant pot or whatever you guys want to use. Beautiful. You can, you can also do it on the stove. <laughs> and you just need to cook the meat, and everything else is cooked. So just start to heat it, warm it, yeah. whatever. Okay, we added the oil. Mom's adding the onion. The onion and the garlic. And then the garlic. And this is already hot. It's on saute right now inside of there. Saute mode. Mm. 
really want to test if this is working. <laughs> make, sure it's make sure it's working. Up next, we're adding our pound of beef. And now we're just gonna saute and cook that until it's cooked fully yeah. through, right, Mom? Yeah. Can I have some uh, the salt and pepper? Okay, now we're adding salt and pepper to taste. And we're just cooking it up. We're just continue done. cooking up until it's no longer red. That's why that's how I want it. But uh, you can always, you know, if you're short of time, you don't have to do this. You can just dump them all here together. Because <laughs> they were all cooked together. Okay, so this is how it should look once you start adding in the rest of the stuff. It's still not fully cooked, but it's like brown enough already. Yes, yeah. So, first thing we're gonna add, just gonna add in the... Anything is, you can add anything first. Now we're gonna add it, we have a specific order. You don't have to have a specific order. Mom has a specific order, she's lying. <laughs> Even though there's not really a specific order. Cause now just everything's just going in all at once. Everything, everything. See, we just skip. This is so easy, it's so easy to make. So, so easy. Oh, I didn't drain the corn. You don't have to drain it. The last but not least is the cream of mushroom. You don't have to add any water or anything else. That's and then you just, just mix eat. it all together yep. in R2-D2. <laughs> and R2-D2 will take care of the rest. <laughs> okay, uh, where is my chili? dirty okay show us how much you're gonna put <laughs> okay now we're adding the chili this is how much mom puts about and a about tablespoon. tablespoon yeah and then you can add later but we like spicy even the kids like spicy so we have no problem with spicy food. Speaking of kids, there's a little angel screaming upstairs. And now we've covered it up and we set it on chili mode, so now it's cooking. Alright you guys, now mom is going to be making her delicious cornbread that goes with um, our chili. So what are we going to do first mom? We have some cornmeal, we have baking powder, we have salt, we have eggs, we have milk, we have some oil, and we have some flour. So, what's the first thing that we're going to be doing? I'm going to get a cup and a half of flour. A cup and a half of all-purpose flour. Yes. Okay. Cornmeal, one half cup of yellow cornmeal. Half a cup of yellow cornmeal. Mm. And I want it sweet, so I put a cup of sugar. Oh, super sweet. This is mom's special ingredient is the sugar. <laughs> oh, like every like the kids literally love these things. They just eat them by themselves. They can eat them for breakfast. They're so I good. Know. Okay, we'll and then we're gonna add 
How much sea salt, mom? A teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon when of um salt. when I was younger, mom used to make this cornbread, and my friends, one of my friends, would come to the house, <laughs> and remember Derek? Like he would, oh my God. he would literally, he would get. We would have like a thing of frosting in the fridge, remember? Yes. There'd be like a tub of frosting. He would put the frosting on the cornbread and eat it like a cupcake. And I was like, <laughs> he was like, it's so good. <laughs> Even though it did taste like a cupcake. <laughs> Cause I tried it, it's actually really good. Imagine it's just like a cornbread cupcake, it's so yummy. But yeah, so that's, these cupcakes, these cupcakes. Really good. These corn, I, this cornbread is really, really good. Doing, oh, yeah. Oil. Okay, how much oil are you putting? One third. One third a cup? Yeah. One third cup of oil. I'm distracting you with this story. Oh my god, your friends are like. They were really always crazy. like, they were always hungry when they came to the house. Mom would make us so much food. Like, all we ever did was eat. That's probably why like, they wanted to come to the house because they're gonna eat. Yes. Yes. And then how much um, uh, how much milk are you gonna put inside? One and one fourth cup. One and one I fourth. Oh, do we have enough milk? Yeah, I know we have we have some more in the garage, but. But do we have enough? Oh in there? yes, we do. <gasps> oh my gosh, yeah, it's fate. Yes. Serendipity. Okay, is that it? And no, we need three tablespoons of melted butter. Oh, we need some melted butter. butter. Yeah, let me just get butter. We're going to just measure three tablespoon. Maybe just use all of them because <laughs> and what else am I going to do with Mom, this? I think R2D2 is beeping over there. What is that? No, mean? that's alright because it came to uh, uh. temperature. All right, then we're gonna mix it together, and that's it. Mm -hmm. And we're ready to make the. We're ready I just to. I them all at the same time rumble. in my bowl, so we don't have to wash a lot of bowls. I want to show them what they can. You just incorporate it until it's all smooth. It doesn't have to be really, really smooth. But just. It will melt, all of this will get, you know, as long as you use the whisk. If you use the whisk, it's easier. This whisk is even ugly. I don't know why I got this. Maybe, got, maybe I got it for free. We've had that whisk forever. <laughs> maybe, it's, maybe it's from New York. I don't know. <laughs> because the whisk now has some fancy handle or something. It does? Uh, yeah. This looks like one of those whisks from this like... This one is like... I don't know, ancient alien. Whisk. Ancient alien. Whisk. <laughs> it's ancient high technology. Okay, you guys. So now I got one of our uh, Pampered Chef cupcake things. These are so good. This is one of the ones I actually thrifted. I thrifted a bunch of these. I always get these because they are like the best in baking plus if you're making a bunch of cupcakes you can't use these over and over you have yeah. to wait for it to cool down you cannot wash it yeah so if you make like a lot of cupcakes or you're planning on making like 24 not just 12 like you're gonna make some for like a class or something you need two of these or else you have to wait in between for it to cool down fully so anyway we have a mom's container full of various cupcake things she has so many designs i don't have to buy mom do the do the rose the pink one that's nice which one that one yeah that's nice you do half pink and then i know the other ones like the boys are gonna want like something no, cool like we don't have pink that one, because it's gonna go with my plate. Oh, I wanted to go. I'm going to make some for the baby. Let's make blue. some Zion ones for Eliza. The baby likes blue. He likes okay. blue. This is what we have to deal with. <laughs> yep. And we have to make him some. Eliza needs like a special, special one. Special. This is beautiful. I found this at Michael's one time. It was on sale for 99 Show it? cents. Ah, so pretty. Beautiful. It's a rose. It's like, I remember one of those um, Yasmin's dresses from, um, what is that brand? 
Laura Ashley. Laura Ashley. I knew it. Yes. That Laura was like Ashley. your favorite store. Oh my god, that's my favorite, favorite children's clothes. Well, they have they have adult clothes too, but they have children's clothes. And Yasmin has this print. <laughs> and I remember it. So I bought so many of these. I can tell, so I can see it from here. I have some more in the, inside the cabinet. <laughs> this is the first time you've used them, because I don't remember you ever no, using them. I would remember it. Before. And I, I've used, I have this since we, ha um, we were in the old house. Okay, now time to, to put make. these in. Mom's just using her cupcake. Ice cream. Uh, cupcake, ice cream, ice cream scoop. scooper. It's easier. guys we have all the cupcakes ready cupcakes <laughs> cornbread I just turned on the oven and forgot to do that so now we're just waiting for it to heat up and then we'll throw in our muffins for dinner tonight um, we're gonna make the harissa flavored chicken thighs which I think is gonna be so delicious this is from Trader Joe's we've never tried this one before so we're very excited to see how it tastes so let me know down below if you guys have tried it and what your favorite pre-marinated meats are from Trader Joe's because we want to try them. Ooh, my oven just went off. Okay, let us put in the cornbread. Let me see if I can do this one-handed of this thing. Beautiful. Yum. All right, you guys, I've got a knock on the door. Oh, it is the butcher box, mom. <laughs> uh, let's go. Slide the butcher box over here. This butcher box looks big, Mom. <gasps> I hear Eliza. Oh, what do we have Thank in here? God, I ordered this again. We're going to Yum. <laughs> Sock eye salmon. What else is in there? A car? Eliza's oh, Show us your car, Eliza. That's three wheels. Wow. The two wheels can move. Oh, that's cool. Magic. We have big. Oh my gosh, Mom. Meat. Look at this. This time. I want this. I'm going to make um, something yummy. You can make uh, Mississippi. Hot roast. Hot roast tomorrow. Ooh, it's gonna be perfect for when it's raining and cold. And Alaska. All right, our muffins are now done. And over here in R2D2, what? our chili is done. Ooh, Ooh steaming hot. Are you ready for some chili, yes. Zachary Binks? Yes. Yummy. Just in time for lunch. All right, you guys, it's time to eat some chili. Look at my cute little leaf thing that I think is also supposed to be a seashell. <laughs> seashell plate with my... Oh, look at Zachary's there. Yeah. Hi, Zach. What did oh, you want to say? What did I you want to say? say? To the viewers, is that sub subscribe, it's free, and also you gotta... If, you, if you're new, hit the notification bell so you never miss a video. Oh. Wow. <laughs> All right, you guys, I'm gonna head over to Walmart really quick to pick up mom's other medicine that wasn't ready yesterday. So we're gonna go there. We're not gonna bring you guys, I'm just gonna leave you guys here. But I'll see you guys again in a second. All right, you guys, it's a little while later. I am in the kitchen with mom. Mom's over there, we're tag teaming dinner. So, I am making the Harissa chicken from Trader Joe's inside our trusty air fryer. Gonna pack this in here. 
Mom, I'm making the kids dinner. <laughs> Mom's making. What what kind of beef are you making? The steak. Beef steak. The steak. The steak. The kids the favorite because we've never had this before. I don't know how the kids will react to it. <laughs> could be good. Could be bad. So I'm gonna cook the chicken, and Mom's over there with the beef. All right, put on a mask. Mom's laughing at me because I have a pimple right here. And I'm trying to counteract it before it gets any crazier, but chicken is looking good. Not done yet though. Mom was already done cooking and I still haven't finished my first batch of chicken. It looks good. I think I just wanted to cook a little bit more. Mom, wanna look at it? Like I set it for, I think, 20, 30 minutes? What did I set it for? I don't even remember. 30 minutes, I think. Look a little more, right? Just a little. Don't use that one. You have to use a new tongue. Let me go on. All right, you guys. Here is the first batch. It looks so good. It looks we're so adding yummy. in some more into the air fryer. And we're talking to... Auntie Violi in the Philippines. Say hi, Auntie. Hi, Star. YouTube. Hi. Say hi. Oh. Wow, Auntie, your hair looks beautiful oh. today. Wow. Yeah. Show them how long your hair is now. She's been growing it out. She's going to be Rapunzel. Yeah. Growing hair. Oh, it's just oh. Beautiful. You're going to be Rapunzel yeah. for Halloween this year. For 2021, you're going to be Rapunzel. Yeah. Alright, you guys. It's time to eat. We have some... We still have some of our garlic... What is it? It's not naan. It's flatbread. It's bread. garlic flat, flatbread. We have our harissa chicken. Ooh, it's fogging up. Rice. And then mom made some pickled cucumbers right there. And then, of course, we have our garlic sauce from Trader Joe's. There's almost no more. And Diet Coke Cola. Wait, this is Coke Zero. Coke Zero. Also, Yasmin's been working on something. We'll show you guys really quickly, but the video's gonna come out soon. Whoop, that's it. All right, guys, dinner is over, and I have this huge pimple. It's so gross. I hope it goes away soon. But cleaning the kitchen now is what I'm gonna do. All right, pretty much all cleaned up. I just gotta put away the air fryer. But yes, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys again so much for hanging out today. Always. Always so much fun taking you guys along my day. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to check out this morning's video. The new video goes up tomorrow by an early at 7 a.m. The new vlog is going to go up at 11. Hopefully tomorrow we're actually going to do Kate's project. Everything goes according to plan. Um, so you guys will hopefully be seeing that exploding soda very soon. Um, what else are we going to tell you guys? Uh, I think that is it for now. Uh, I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Alright, bye!